Oh my god, this is so exciting. This is our first official van vlog. Yeah, and we're actually out and about. So we're currently at Bradford on Avon. Which I keep saying. What do I keep saying? Bradford on Avenue, and I was just I like, don't, I don't know why. Not where we are. But we've basically parked the van, and we haven't gone to our campsite. But look how pretty this is. It's so pretty. It's all like cobbly and like just like very like cottagey and like. Um, Villagey, very like British villagey. And this is all based in the Cotswolds, isn't it? Yeah, so we're in Cotswolds. There's loads of little villages like this. This is like a really popular one. And then tomorrow we're going to Castle um, Cove. Um, which we're super excited. That's like the like a really, really popular. That's the one you really want to go That's to. That's the one that I like reason why we're on this trip basically. Um took us about an hour and forty minutes to get here. And the roads are pretty van friendly for anyone that's just got their van too. Yeah. Like it wasn't it's too easy, crazy. It's easy to drive, but they it? are like small country roads so you have to be like yeah. aware. There's just traffic when we went past Salisbury. There's always traffic going that way. But it's so like it's so peaceful. Um parked the van no problems. And like oh there's just little ducks and stuff like that. I'm gonna go over there and sit, but we're gonna go and try and find some food. Because it is actually 20 past three on a Friday afternoon and all we've had today, I've not had anything, have you? Tap water. I had a piece of brownie, I had some cookie dough, so yeah, I've eaten. Um, but also, we before we came here, we brought like two camper seat chairs. Oh my god, I can't wait to show you. Which is so right, exciting. Don't tell anything else what we brought, because we popped into right. Go Adventure and we got some really cute stuff. And we got some super cute stuff in the range. The van has already had a makeup, which we're so excited to share. But yeah, we're going to take a little look around and see what we can find. <laughs> So one thing I have noticed is basically everywhere, every shop actually has what are they called? Baskets, flowers, flowers and baskets. Like literally every shop we go past just has. Our house, because we've got loads. You wish, jellyfish. Like every shop just has like flowers, and baskets. It's so pretty. So we're finally here at the campsite. This one is called, what did we say, Orchard Farm. And Orchard it says Farm. Orchard Farm and Tea Rooms. So I'm hoping there's some tea rooms. And I'm pretty sure we're gonna park over there. Yeah, I suppose we're allowed to park. This is where, this is where the electric hookups are. We should say anything past number five. So we're gonna go to the corner um, to watch the sunset. Um, everyone's looking at like they've never seen the camera. I feel really safe here, actually. Um, it's gonna be really, wow. Like, we're gonna go like, by around here. I'll have it so we've got enough room for Roscoe's little one. Yeah, and then we've got, oh, it's so pretty. Wow. There's some people over there. We want this view, don't yeah, we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it was actually really cheap. I think it was about... It was £15 per night. And there's the toilets. The toilets, when you drive in, they didn't actually look too bad, actually. They just look like a little, like, c cabin. Um, but yeah, really, really happy. Really quite happy with this. I definitely feel quite safe. Um, I think while we're trying to start because we don't know if we're going to start, like, like, parking and off camp the and grid. Park, yeah. Like, a little bit off the grid. Especially, like, one night or two nights just save a little bit of money. But especially if, like, we're not sure. Um, especially when it gets more, like, cold, I feel like a lot of, like, campsites don't open up. Oh and we'll still want to go places. Um, so we might have to start adventuring now. But we've just arrived in Sunset. We actually went to, Mo well, actually, Matthew went into Morrison's to get some food. Well, we stayed in the car. Do you know where we are? So we're all set up for someone forgot their jumper. Got my coat. Literally an idiot. So we've got, you're gonna have to have the duvet in that or the jumper. You either get one or the other. These, we basically went to go outdoors. That's what it's called, isn't it? Go outdoors. Yeah. Went to go outdoors earlier and got some really cute chairs. They have blue or red or flowers. And basically this is the, um, uh, Cooler. So this is going to be our fridge. So it's basically an electric cooler, cooler which is going to act as our fridge. Because you did say it warms up, didn't you? Yeah, it also warms up, but I don't know why we would need that, but you never know. I'm going to go in there to warm myself up. But we basically, it is actually really cold. <laughs> um, we basically don't eat meat, really. Well, I'm pescatarian and you sometimes well, it's eat just meat. For basically the gin. M milk, gin, that kind of thing. It's really, really cute. And just like salad. 
salad. But we're gonna have the best view tomorrow. I'm so, oh god, I almost fell. So excited. Ooh, the guy who was really nice, he said that apparently there's like a nice dog walk, like nice. a mile walk. Nice dog walk. So this place was called Orchard Farm for anyone that wants to come to, um, what's it, it really called? Nice. What's this whole area called? Um, Cots. Cotswolds. No, yeah. If anyone wants to go to Cotswolds, Which, definitely yeah. check this out. It's really just like simple. Yeah, there is electric hook up over there, so if we did need to change, I'm sure we could because there's not many people here. But we just didn't bother paying for that right now. But um, we now have to sort out this absolute pigsty. <laughs> Lots of bits. But look how cute our mat is. A we'll, new mat. we'll do a proper. We still need to do a van tour, actually, and like we a got proper a new one. Duvet. A new duvet, but I think we may save a lot of this for the actual van tour. Yeah, we're gonna do a van tour. Hopefully, maybe tomorrow evening, or tomorrow morning, and we'll make sure it's all like prestige and proper. Cute. <laughs> oh my God, there he is. He's got a little hack. What did you get? A little mirror. A little mirror, so you can take off your makeup. And put it on. Very cool. Do you like it? Yeah, actually. So we are now going to. We did just show this on the vlog, didn't we? The fridge. Yeah. We're gonna. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Are you chilly or something? You keep shaking. Food in. We need to put all the food in here. So I'm gonna open the cooler. I'm actually really excited. I know Roscoe. I'm really sorry. So we've got Roscoe and his nice in-ground leads. So you can't run it's away. Actually pretty cheap and actually really good. What the lead? Yeah. It only cost us what three pounds or yeah. something. Um, so that's pretty good in my eyes. So I'm just gonna. Open this. Oh, oh Roscoe, is this? Is this a cooler? You think it's a toy? It's not, it's actually a cooler. Whoa, hot or cold. Let's take it out. They had other ones, but the lady recommended this one. Well, it's the same price. It was the same price as the, as the cheap looking one. Oh my God, it'll be ready. I'm just gonna prop this here. <laughs> Who's ready to see our new cooler? Da, 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 da. Oh god, I'm fucking out. Oh my god, it's huge. Hello there, would you like some water from my cooler? Uh, it's wet. Why is it wet? Uh, something. <laughs> smell my fingers. No, thank you. I'm not smelling your fingers. <laughs> my fingers might pass. How nice is that? One eye saw. It's so ugly. <laughs> but it's fine. When we're in here, it's gonna literally be in the front anyway. Um, Something's wet. Why is that all wet? All right. Be right back, guys. Oh my god! So we're literally just chilling and look at the sky. Like the sunset is so pretty. I don't feel like the camera does it justice. It is literally so cute. So this is our setup. It's not cold. Wind stopped out there. Mm, there's a little bit of a breeze, but I feel like we're like shouting. Even though this looks awful at the moment, we've got our little decorations hanging up, which is cute. Um, and that'll go, the little storage freezer thing will go at the top. There's Fosco. Um, and it's just so pretty. Let me try and zoom in, see if you can. Let me zoom in. Can you see it? So, for tonight at the Victor, and I don't know why it's flashing weird like this, it's definitely the lights. No, the lights, it's, it's the lights make it all flickery. Um, yeah, but we have got Camelot's onion and Ollie's pork pies in the Victor in. Really cute. Mm. Right, babe, in this bag, no, I've got a surprise, okay? Close your eyes. Mm -hmm. So, this is the game that we're playing tonight. <laughs> Hold out your hands, don't open. Oh, 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 oh. Don't open. Oh. Jenga! Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm glad we've got a really nice. We're going to do it on my laptop oh, because the table's. No, it's not as fun. I want it to be more brain stimulating. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Basically, he wanted to teach you how to play chess. I was like, who plays chess? I love chess. <sighs> oh, that's an early night for us then. <laughs> Look at that yawn. <laughs> Not the most chatty thing. I can't deal with the strobe lights. <laughs> Pally, so we are basically, I'm making make it quick. We're in bed now. We've got Roscoe's down there already under. He's here. We went for pee actually in the dark. It was really scary, really creepy. Well, he, oh, I just can't cope with you. And you... Matthew was just being an idiot. It was and like, I was like, Whoa. He was like, let's walk around the van just in case. And I was just like, my book's really scary. So I was like, great. But. Oh, wait, I, I'm so impressed with the room. Like, I've got, like, some stuff behind me. I still have, like, loads yeah, of room. I've got loads of room. I'm so glad, like, 
this fan is like roomy, even though I've got the olives next to me that I keep getting whiffs of herbs. <laughs> I'm going to move those. We just need to, I feel like I just want to organise the van, like the drawers and stuff, they're not organised. We need to figure out a good way how we can utilise the See you tomorrow, it, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, everybody. How did she sleep? Awful. <laughs> I slept awful because it was really cold. And basically, this grill <laughs> is just really thin. But lesson learnt. Um, tonight, I'm gonna make sure. I feel like, like, just gaff it at the bottom. Gonna make sure it's actually like. Yeah, it's literally the thinnest quilt ever. Yeah. I think we need to get a proper one. So I think we're gonna actually get like a proper wintry. Uh, quilt. Um, however, it was comfortable. It was just a little bit chilly, um, but it's all right. Um, <laughs> we woke up. Um, we've actually got to get lighter because basically this is gas, and you need a lighter to actually light it so we can make hot drinks. Um, so I think there's a co-op not far from here, so we're gonna go there. Um, and then come back oh, and yeah. just chill. We're going to have to pack everything away. How does that make you feel? <laughs> but, like, there's literally so much stuff that we have to pack. Um, just to make sure it doesn't fall. It won't take too long, to be honest. At least it's done. It's done. And then we come back and just chill. Um, I also need a poo. So, I'm going to have to fetch the toilet soon. Um, but I'm going to hold it as, po as long as possible. So we have just been to co-op and they didn't have a lighter so Matthew got some matches and I did actually ask for pastry. However, Matthew being Matthew picked up chocolate so picked up some chocolate. But these are like orange twirls. I've literally never They're ever seen. Actually limited editions, that's why you've never seen them, you oh. absolute pleb. Shut up. This is the life. So we're literally just chilling. It's really nice. It's really nice. We've actually just using the kettle for the first time. That um, and actually matches worked really, really well. It's on. I think Matthew's still a little bit scared. Uh, and we're gonna basically make our tea and coffee, which I packed in. Oh, can't reach. I packed in these like little containers, which we got from Japan when we went last year, and they're super, super cute. What's in that one? This is the coffee one, and then your one's up there with the tea, which it's like all seasons. How cool I love is this? That. that one's so cute. Isn't so it? I packed loads of tea bags for Matthew, and it's just so cute. And it means they're not going to go anywhere. And I put them in these cups whilst the tea's boiling. It's a whistle one, so hopefully it whistles when it's done. Lighten Someone's it. making <laughs> eggs. I'm really excited. This is our first meal in the van. Are you excited? I am. Oh, I think you're very excited. Are you getting it everywhere, are you? We're just having three. Yeah, you've got, you got pastry as well, Matthew. And a chocolate twirl, so I think we'll probably be okay. But we're very excited. The kettle is currently boiling. I feel like if we had this on at night, it would be a really good heat source. Yeah, it's quite nice. So breakfast, first breakfast in the van was our success. So we had, I cooked the eggs. I was actually really surprised how quick they cooked. They cook really quick. They like, they? literally like five minutes. And our tea and coffee are over there just cooling. Um, it turned off because we had to open the door, which is annoying so we didn't get to hear the whistle. But are they nice? Really nice, thanks. And then literally, we're just gonna just chill out and just enjoy this view of our breakfast. So we are all packed up, as you can see. Um, we have a nice breakfast. Um, put the bed back, and we basically just had a bit of chill time, and we did some content. And now we are gonna head to Castle Cove, which is the place that I really wanted to go. It's about half an hour from here. We really want to get this shot. There's like a bridge, and we want to get our fan in there as well. Um, but hopefully it just won't be too busy so we can get it, um, get that shot. Um, but Oscar's and the front ready to go. Um, I, mean, I really want to get something badminton, so just play badminton later in the sun. Um, but no idea where we get it. Oh, our bin just blown over. Good, I best pick that up, but no idea where to get that. So we're going to have a little look. Um, this bit of wind, I'm hoping you can hear me. But yeah, we're basically gonna wait for Matthew and then we're gonna head off and I can't wait to explore Castle Cove. So this one is literally guarding the fan. He's Go so on. cute. Go over. <laughs> So we 
didn't realise that it was going to be this busy. But basically, we want to get a shot here with our van parked on this little bridge. But so we're going to come here super early tomorrow morning to get that shot and park. Like half six, seven, like so early. Yeah, just so we can get it. But it's so pretty. So we're just going to come here and get a look. Oh, it's so 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 pretty like but we're going to still park and explore it's actually a free car park which is always a yeah. plus but it's really really pretty we made it to castle Cove village and what's even more exciting is it's free parking it, it is ca free so you have to pay it's like free <laughs> i can't get over it so we've decided that we're actually going to come here super early as you saw in the video just uh for this that it's like super super busy so we're just going to come here like super early tomorrow morning to get the shot it's like a particular shot isn't it yeah with the fan which we're determined to get it so we're just gonna um walk around spot any other shots we want to get tomorrow and then we're just gonna actually just enjoy it i'm so expecting we're just gonna enjoy it and then i can still take a few shots of matthew get all our stories and then tomorrow morning we can just come back it's only like 20 minute drive and then just get the shots without like rushing or like Impressive. stress and then we'll just go back and enjoy the morning before we set off um to back home really to go and play Pokemon Go with my sister but it's so pretty here um, and also our tripod's so heavy so it's just nice not to nice actually to chill and enjoy it yeah. Being a responsible dog owner, picking up Roscoe's poo poo. I don't want to start a lady like that one there to try to. Oh my god, that would be awful. This is literally the cutest little setup, basically. Everything has this price on, and you literally just put the money for the letterbox. How cute and like trusting is that? So now we're gonna go get some um, creams and scones. I don't tell you that he's always told me that I'm paying. You're <laughs> paying, mate. It's your turn. And Roscoe is so excited because he thinks he's getting one too. So, babe, what have you got? So, we have got scone, jam, and cottage cream. Obviously, with a good cup of tea. Literally, the view is actually insane. This is honestly so nice. It doesn't feel like we're in England at so, all. I want to say, like, Italy. Italy or France. Why have we never been here before? It's literally only an hour and a half away from home. Isn't that ridiculous? Oh, love it. And did I mention free parking? <laughs> we've literally just, basically, we're walking Roscoe into the forest and we've just come across the cutest things I've ever seen. It's a little pixie home. How cute Not is that? That's so cool. It's a little fairy home, sorry. Not pixie fairy. That's so cool. That's so really cute. Cool. I'm back at the campsite. I've just got into some tracky bottoms and we're gonna actually enjoy the sunset. It's a little bit breezy, which I don't mind. Um, and I've taken my makeup off. We had such a nice day. Did you have a nice day? I did have a nice day. Oh, what are you doing? <laughs> However, someone has stole our spot oh, over there. Oh, but you know, we don't hold grudges. Oh. I can't believe they stole our spot. Um, but we had such a nice time. We've got the evening to chill. We couldn't find any badminton, could we? So we're going to play Jenga. So we're going to play Jenga. Jenga. Um, but we're just going to chill out. Um, we we'll film most of our content. We're going to go back tomorrow morning. I'm going to put some Instagram stories up now. So if you don't follow us on Instagram, make sure you do follow us on Instagram and just enjoy this view. I do think we'll actually go for a walk a bit later on. The guy said, the guy said that like, you can follow this all the way down. And it goes quite like a mile long. I don't even know how long a mile is, but we're just gonna take an hour to chill out. It's a lot later. We basically just walked around here with Roscoe, which is really nice. And now we're having our dinner. <laughs> picnic what? snacks. We're having picnic snacks. We've got some crackers, hummus, crackers, corn, corn ch chicken free slices, which are really nice. And then some smoked. What's this? My favourite cheese, which is um, uh, smoked cheese, which I just love. And then we're gonna play Jenga and chill definitely feels like a little bit more um warmer mm. than it was yesterday uh -huh. by by now i've i feel like yesterday we were like starting to really feel it but i'm sad that it's half seven it's getting dark though 
I know. I hate it when it gets darker in the evenings. I know. Oh, as soon as it'll be like 4 pm, it'll be dark. Take two, because basically you have things hanging up. Um, good morning, everybody. So it's literally just gone 7 o'clock, and we are already off back to Castle Cope Village because we are determined to get the shot with the van for Instagram. That's how dedicated we are to our work. Um, and we're going to take a few other shots, and that's why we're going to change outfits just in the van. Uh, and we're going to come back and have breakfast. I actually am not too tired. How are you feeling, sir? I'm not tired. Um, but I'm gonna do my makeup in the van, um, so I look a little bit more fresh faced, basically. Um, and yeah, I'm praying that literally no one, no one is there. I'd be so pissed off. It'd be very furious. This is the shot that we wanted. <laughs> now we're gonna take our Polaroid, which we're gonna do every time. So all shots are now done, but there's literally no, no one here. Yeah. It's the part of most people came walking at the right up. time because it's there are people coming out. So pretty. Like that's why the person made the cakes where you just put the money in, and she has two dogs. We've just seen her. She said good morning to us. And she went just in. taking photos up here, and then I <clears> took <throat> some hideous photos here, which I've just deleted. And then we took some here with all this in the background. And now we're gonna head back for some breakfast. And Roscoe is like, I just want to snooze. I just want to snooze. So Matthew today was on <clears throat> breakfast duty. So we have got some egg and beans and the coffee and tea. And we're back just enjoying the view. I have to say, you've definitely did a good job. Wow, thank you. We haven't tasted it. And then I'm gonna read my book and just enjoy like an hour of chilling. And we've eaten a few strawberries and it just looks really good. Mm. All packed up apart from this little nugget. Um, we basically just packed our van, made sure all things that are movable aren't going to move whilst we're travelling back and everything's put in bags and stuff like that. We literally had the best time. It's, oh, it's windy. Did you have a good time? It was so good. And now it's time to catch Pokemon. Basically, it's Pokemon Day, so we're going to head back and um, go Pokemon going with Matthew's sister in Southampton. Which but the nice. sun's out. It's just, oh, it's just really, really nice and this one's just like I'm over it. I'm tired guys. I'm tired and I want to go back. <laughs> but it was so much fun. I really do rate um, Orchid Orchard Farm. Orchard Farm is really good so if you are in the Cotswolds and you want somewhere cheap to stay, yeah. stay here. So Wiltshire area. Like, I'll leave the link down below actually so you guys can see It's really really saying. good like, and they're really really fun. They just leave you to it and like there's toilets and everything you need and there's such a big field so you could just literally play badminton tennis. There's a little village just around and it's like a mile since like 10 minutes away so it's pretty handy. But if you guys did like this video make sure you give it a big fat thumbs up. Please leave a comment down below and let us know what fan videos you guys want and yeah, we haven't done a fan tour actually, which no. is something we do need to do. Um, but yeah, any fan videos, and then leave a comment. But also, we do put on Instagram and TikTok, so all the links will be down below. We love you guys so Hi. much, and I can't even look at you anymore because the sun is right in my eyes. But love you guys so much, Bye. and we shall see you soon. Bye. Bye.